Hey, what's up, YouTube, and welcome back to the channel. As far as we receive a new jailbreak, and I'm talking here about the Uncover and the Chimera jailbreak, starting from iOS 11 up to 12.2. So let's go ahead and talking about some tweaks for that new jailbreak. Before I'm gonna be start today's video, let me ask you guys to give the video a big thumbs up. Also, make sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell, so you will be notified always whenever I release a tweaks video. Okay, so let's go ahead right now to talking about the first week that I have for you guys in today's video. I will be talking about the Dark Module CC11. Pretty much once you install the tweak on your device, that will be provide you with a dark mode for your control center module. So if you want to take a look right now on my control center, you will be something a little bit different. If I want to compare that right now with my other device here to show you guys what is the difference between the both so you can take a look right now between that device here and the other device you will be see and you can compare right now by yourself so this is what pretty much the tweak will be provide you with if I want to bring that a closer little bit and showing you guys what I mean here so you can take a look right now how is it the dark mode will be work for your manual here so th this is the way about that week and this is how is that we will be provide you with once you install it in your iDevice. About the settings, there is nothing to configure. The tweak will be work right away once you install it in your iDevice. And yeah, as I told you guys, if you want to install this tweak in your iDevice, that we call Dark Module CC11. Let me right now talking about the next CD tweak. Let me talking about the Telt paper. So if you want to scroll through your wallpaper, go ahead and download this tweak. Let me show you guys what I'm talking about it here. So if you want to take a look right now about my wallpaper here, so you can go through all those uh, wallpaper. And in order to do that, go ahead and download something bigger than the wallpaper that you have on your phone. So you can, for example, search for the windows or the mac wallpaper something will be bigger than the regular iphone wallpaper and it will be looks like this using that tweak right there about the settings once you download the tweak there is nothing to configure so once you download the tweak right away it will be work after you add the wallpaper that i told you about it on your iDevice so anyway, if you want to do that on your iDevice, go ahead and download the tall paper. Let me right now jump to talking about the next CD tweak. Let me talking about the Pexel. So once you download the tweak, that tweak will be bring a beautiful and nice volume hood into your iDevice. Let me show you guys how is it that hood or the style of that hood on your iDevice. So you can take a look right now. How is it beautiful in the top? Pretty much it looks like the YouTube volume. So uh, this is what the tweak once you installed, it will be provide you with that style of volume on your iDevice. About the settings, once you download the tweak, there is nothing to configure. The tweak will be work right away once you install it on your I device so yeah guys if you want to bring that volume hood into your device that we called pascal the next cd tweak i will be talking about the power advance so once you download the tweak that tweak will be provide you with more than option if you want to shut down your device if you want to reset your device if you want to bring your device on a safe mode and the last option the cancel so this is what pretty much the power advance will be provide you with once you install it in your i device so as i told you guys this is what pretty much the tweak will be provide you with and that we called as i told you guys power advanced the next see that week let me talking about the top emoji 11 so once you download the tweak that week will be uh, allow you to add any kind of emoji into your lock screen if i want to show you guys the way how i made my lock screen with the uh, favorite emoji that i have right now this is how it's gonna be it looks like so if you want to customize that and i'm i'm about to show you guys right now how you can do that from under the settings 
So there you go guys, we are right now under the settings. First thing, go ahead and enable the tweak and this is the text here. So if, if you go ahead right now and tap on it, you can bring, you can add a text, you can bring an emoji, you can add anything you like to add in your black screen. After you're done, just go ahead and close your keyboard, go ahead and reset bring your device and this is how is that week will be work on your iDevice. So as I show you guys, this is how it's gonna be the lock screen will be beautiful with your emoji if you want to use that tweak on your iDevice. So I highly recommend you guys to give it a try. If you want to, you can go ahead and download the top emoji 11. So anyway guys, this is the most tweak that I want to share with you guys in today's video. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Don't forget, give the video a huge thumbs up and also make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever I release a new video. Catch you with the next one. Peace.